Sandra Bullock was quietly dating and raising her children with her partner, Brian Randall. While the pair were never married, after they met in 2015, they kept the details of their blossoming romance behind the scenes. Sadly, it was announced on Monday that Brian had died at the age of 57 after secretly battling with ALS, according to a family statement. They revealed Brian died over the weekend, following a three-year fight with the disease. The emotional statement read, It is with great sadness that we share that, on August 5th, Brian Randall passed away peacefully after a three-year battle with ALS, his family shared. Brian chose early to keep his journey with ALS private, and those of us who cared for him did our best to honor his request. Speaking to people, the family continued, We are immensely grateful to the tireless doctors who navigated the landscape of this illness with us and to the astounding nurses who became our roommates, often sacrificing their own families to be with ours. At this time, we ask for privacy to grieve and to come to terms with the impossibility of saying goodbye to Brian. The statement concluded, before it was signed, his loving family. The Hollywood actress, 59, first met the model-turned-photographer in 2015. He was the photographer at her son's birthday party in the January of the year. Later that year, they announced their relationship to the public and made an appearance together at the wedding of Jennifer Aniston and Justin Theroux. The pair then went on a double date with Jennifer and Justin and made multiple red appearances, sweet holidays away, and coffee dates. In November 2021, Sandra gave Fan a rare glimpse into her relationship with the photographer, who she met at her son's birthday party after she hired him to take photos at the event. On an episode of Red Table Talk with Jada Pinkett Smith, Sandra explained that Brian had nothing to do with her adoption plans, saying, I had Lewis first. Then when I met him, we hadn't been together that long, and I said, Remember that NDA you signed when you photographed my son? You know that still holds because I'm bringing home a child when I come back from Toronto. Sandra recalled Brian being both happy and scared after hearing her plans to adopt again, but she admitted that ultimately he was a saint about the situation. She said, he's very patient, a saint. He has evolved on a level that is not human.